What's going on, Lego Maniacs? It's Ty, the Lego guy here. And today we're taking a look at an awesome city set. We don't give city enough love on the channel and I'm trying to change that. But the model we're taking a look at is the fire truck that set 60002. It had 209 pieces, too many figs, came out in 2013 and it retailed for 20 US. Now nowadays this set's going for 40 new or 14 news. And I have to say, when I bought this back in 2013, I wasn't anything of a city guy, but I saw this set. I thought, you know what, I need to have it. We're gonna get into exactly why, but enough talk, let's get right into it. And to start off the model, I'll just show you guys right now the smaller build that's included. You get a little fire hydrant. So that actually has some playability a little bit with it. We're gonna get into that. But let's actually now show you guys the meat of the set, which is obviously the fire truck. Let's give you guys a 360 view of it. Very, very nice looking for 20 bucks. I was actually surprised how big it was and how many features this set has. So now that we got the 360 view out of the way, you'll notice it has very nice drivability. If you're a kid and you wanna play with it, fantastic for that. But let's show off one of my favorite things to do with this set, and that is the cabin. So how you kinda of access it is you just literally lift this, and this was the main selling feature. And the awesome thing about it as well is you can fit two figs. So it is quite sizable, it's a one by six, and you can fit two figs in there, no problem. Really, really like that. This kinda of harkens back a little bit to the older style of Lego City, I just get older style city vibes from it. The other thing that's cool about it as well, now it is a little tricky, you gotta really pull, pull it up. There's a little door here and in here, now I just put the tube and we're gonna actually get into that because there's a feature, but you can also put the blue flame in there as well when you wanna kinda transport it. But what will you actually do with this is let's just pull this out and show you guys. Flip her around. A fire hydrant obviously needs water. And what you can kind of do with this is connect it to the fire hydrant. And now the fire truck, in theory, now has water. So I thought that was really cool. They're trying to make it pretty realistic. The other thing that's nice about this uh, set as well is it has nice little gauges on the sides. Now, yeah, these are stickers, but I do think they add some nice detail. You can see he has a little walkie-talkie. There's a little saw. Wrench, axe, another, I believe that's supposed to be just a, a, a smaller fire extinguisher. And I love the fact that it has fire 60002, that's the set number, and they're incorporating that in the set. So that's awesome. The other thing that's cool about it is you'll notice right here, you can actually, you twist this in, and literally you can pull in the fire hose. So I thought that's great, great for transportation. Now it's ready to go. Oh, also it has a nice little license plate. This little model has it all. That's what I really appreciated about it. But now let's actually take a look at the ladder. So how that kind of works, literally it pulls out just like so. Now we're gonna extend this completely because we're gonna be pulling this little dude up. You can slap on the blue flame and you can actually extend this ladder. Check this out. You can extend this ladder. Say it almost goes a foot. That is awesome. This is such a great little city fire truck. I, literally for 20 bucks, you couldn't have included any more. The other thing too I wanna mention before we move on to the figs is this ladder, I wanted to adjust the camera a little bit, can be moved, well he keeps falling, three, well not 360, but nearly 360, it can do a 180, which I think is actually quite awesome. Here we have the two figs that are included. You get two firemen, but what I love about it is this one actually has a fire suit on, and this one's just a normal fireman. Turn him around. Nice looking little back torso printing. Now that we have his backpack taken off, you can kind of see it has another little fire emblem logo. So all in all, very nice looking. I also love the fact that you can kind of make him like a normal fireman and then you can put his suit on. Yeah, it would've been nice maybe if they included one more fig, but for 20 bucks, these aren't bad, and they actually gave you two different mini figs, which I appreciate instead of just giving us two of the same figs, which they love to do back in the day with uh, Lego. 
But yeah, those are the minifigs. Let's now get into the end of the review and get my final thoughts. Well guys, that was my review. Do hope you enjoyed it. Honestly, for 20 bucks, this set has it all. It has an awesome, awesome cockpit. It has that ladder that extends so far. It has all those different little items. It's just the perfect $20 fire truck. What sold me on it at the store, again, was just that cockpit. I just think it looks fantastic. The cabin, whatever you wanna call it. All in all, you can't go wrong for 20 bucks, but let me know what you guys think about this one. If you like it, if you don't, any areas you think they can maybe improve on it. I just think that it's all in all a really solid model. Uh, but yeah, that's all I got for you today. But if you like this video, leave it a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, definitely consider subscribing and click that bell so you're notified for any future LEGO City reviews. Trying to get more into the uh, theme, especially with modulars. And this is part of the reason why I think City is actually pretty awesome. Uh, but yeah, that's all I got for you again. But thanks again for watching and I'll catch you on the next one.